Big differences with uh, kind of our cephalic catheters are going to be that rabbit skin is a lot more tough than people often think that it is. So don't forget that you can utilize a pilot hole to be able to place those catheters. Otherwise, the procedure is very similar to what you would expect for a dog or a cat. For saphenous vein catheters, those are going to be fairly similar to dogs and cats with a few exceptions. You can utilize a pilot hole on the saphenous uh, vein kind of area. The skin in the pelvic limbs doesn't seem to be as tough as the skin in the forelimbs, but just don't forget about that as an option. The location of the saphenous vein is going to be a little further caudal than what you're used to for a dog and a cat. So what I advise is prior to shaving, prior to prepping, make sure that you kind of hold off the leg and kind of visualize and palpate the location and then kind of get prepped um, just because it is a little bit caudal. The other thing about it is it can be a little bit tortuous. So make sure that when you're identifying where to place your catheter, that you end up having a nice straight shot for that one as well.